Okay, we're gonna go over the tier, another tier two class here, which is the dual wielder. This is one of my classes I use a lot before they added Berserker, Powder, and Mage of Light. Uh, this is a fun class. It's a high DPS, but it can, it has to hit a lot, uh, pretty much, uh, to do a lot of DPS. So, we're gonna unlock it. We don't have it unlocked on this character, sadly, but nothing too expensive. Uh, 25. Uh, these uh, tier two, a uh, tier one uh, classic hits that we have here, and now we have uh, Dooglither unlocked. So here are the uh, abilities here. So Dooglither is a bit different than other classes. The longer you hold down your attacks, the faster you attack, and it'll get faster and faster. The longer you uh, hold down um you can see how fast it hits it's pretty strong um it's better it's better to show this you know when you actually uh have a tanky enemy you can see that how the attacks here there are white slashes right but when we start attacking um or continue, or continue attacking here um you can see that it will start to go uh yellow that means that it gets faster and faster Oof, somebody has came here and now my my training spot is he gonna die? I don't even know. But yeah, it gets orange basically. Damn it! Why did the people come here? <laughs> but yes, that is the gimmick of uh, dual wielder. The longer you hold it, the faster you attack, which equals more DPS, pretty much. So. What that means is that there's the second ability here, which is our first ability, Combat Rhythm. This is puts you at max tempo, which means what I'm talking about when you instead of instead of holding out instead of you know attacking an enemy, uh, it will get you all ready at max attack speed and times two crit as well chance. So here's an example of this. You get a blue glow. But you're at, but it's a very low, very low uh, buff you get. And the reason why it's a low buff is because once you get a kill, it makes it go longer. But at, at a cap, I think they changed that. They changed this. So if you kill an enemy, you see now it's 10 seconds now, 12 seconds. So every time you get a kill, tempo it will you'll keep your tempo. Maybe there's no max. I'm not entirely sure. If you keep getting kills here, let me see. Nope. Uh, let's see. Get keep getting kills. Yep, it keeps going up. So you can actually be max tempo for a very long time. Infinitely now. Uh, that's a nice buff to deal building. As long as you can keep your tempo, you always now will always have be a max attack speed and also have a times two crit rate. So you, you'll crit more often than normal. So this is what deal builders can do pretty much. It lasts forever. You can keep unless you until you hold your temp at least keep holding your tempo. Uh, I know if you're fighting a boss, you're not gonna. It's not gonna happen. So you need. To, it's mainly for ads, for the most most of the most of the time. Oh, there you go. This is uh, combat rhythm. It's a pretty nice ability for uh, dual wielders, uh, for sure. Our next ability we have here is uh, dash strike. This one is a really strong ability. It is. It makes you a dash forward. So here's without an enemy, you dash forward slightly. And does a lot of damage, if I remember correctly. So here's an example. Here's the Crystal Spider. Here you go. That's a lot, a lot of damage you can do. It gives you, you know, a slight boost. Um, it's six k crit at uh, at this level. Of course, level damage doesn't matter that much depending on where you are in the game. But it does. It feels like it does. You know, it's always a, it's a very good starter to fight things just to go fast. I like using it a lot. Is very useful, I feel, uh, for a dash strike. Second, uh, third ability, we have cross slash. Cross slash is your range ability. It can do multiple ticks of damage and it hits twice. So the two slashes count as two hits, and then it could tick multiple times, or depending on the length of the enemy. Here's another example: of crystal spider. Hit twice there. I'm actually hit multiple times. It could be just two times, two ticks. But to, it'll hit, it does two ticks of two. So four hits basically. 
like I said, I'm not sure if it hit multiple times. Uh, more than more than four, but uh, it's a really good ability. It's on a eight second cooldown. It's pretty short. So this dash strike is six second cooldown, which is really short as well. You can just spam this one if you want. Spam that. It's very it's a very fast it's a very fast paced class. You're gonna be spamming your abilities. You wanna make sure you you know keep your tempo up, do damage, use your abilities here and there. Of course, when you use your tempo and your other abilities, you're gonna have a that times two crit rate. So your other better your other abilities have a chance to crit more often as well, instead of just using, you know. Uh, using uh, tempo and your other bit without tempo on pretty much a max tempo so it, it is pretty useful to use these abilities lastly we have our ultimate ability which is blade dance similar to the sword art, sword art not sword art yes sword art <laughs> anime uh, uh, ability um, Basically, it will reduce your enemy's defense and do a 28 hit combo. It is a move where it stands still, so use it on a boss or anything. If you don't know what an ultimate ability does, uh, it, it's a one-time use, and then it doesn't go on cooldown, it goes on a percent. You either charge up your percent either by just waiting or killing enemies or charge it up slowly. So here, we're going to check the ability out. If it gets stunned, it does get, you know... Uh, stopped so we get stunned there sadly and there you go that's the damage we did it's not bad and then when we kill enemies you can see that our percent goes up a little bit faster now we're at 30 percent already from killing these frost golems there we go 40 percent already pretty much how it goes there so that's pretty much Deal Wooder. It's a very deep, high, very fast paced class. You do a lot of DPS. It's good for clearing missions and stuff. You can go really fast on missions by doing spamming, you know, making sure that you keep your tempo up by going through each uh, area. Make sure you get kills, use your abilities uh, here and there, and just keep running around. I used Deal Wooding a lot to run around, uh, doing quests and stuff. It's pretty good to use. Like I said, very fast paced class. I enjoy it. One of my. One of my favorite ones, uh, for sure. There we go.